Welcome to Zanzibar, the idyllic island paradise off the coast of Tanzania in East Africa. Known as the Spice Island for its rich history of trading in exotic spices, Zanzibar is a melting pot of cultures and traditions. We have prepared for you the best places you have to visit when traveling to Zanzibar. Let's jump right in. Nungwi Beach in Zanzibar is a true paradise on Earth. Located on the northern tip of the island, it boasts crystal clear turquoise waters, soft white sand, and an idyllic fishing village that exudes a sense of tranquility and relaxation. It comes as no surprise that Nungwi Beach is one of the top rated beaches in Zanzibar, attracting tourists from all corners of the globe who are seeking a blissful escape. What makes Nungwi Beach so special is the diversity of activities and experiences it offers. For those who love to bask in the sun and swim in the warm waters of the Indian Ocean, Nungwi Beach is the perfect spot. The calm waters and gentle waves make it an ideal place to enjoy a refreshing dip, while the soft sand invites visitors to lie down and soak up the sun. The beach is also perfect for water sports such as snorkeling, scuba diving, and jet skiing. The coral reefs surrounding Nungwi Beach are home to an abundance of marine life, including colorful fish, sea turtles, and even dolphins. The beach is also surrounded by a charming fishing village where visitors can experience the local culture and traditions of Zanzibar. The village is home to traditional dhow boats, which are still used for fishing and transportation, and visitors can take a ride on one of these boats to explore the nearby islands or watch the sunset over the Indian Ocean. Also, visitors can watch as they carve, shape, and assemble the wooden planks to create a magnificent vessel. It's a fascinating process that showcases the rich cultural heritage of Zanzibar and the skills of its people. The village also has a bustling night market, where locals and tourists alike come to sample delicious local cuisine, buy souvenirs, and socialize. Manemba Atoll is a breathtakingly beautiful coral island situated off the coast of Zanzibar. With its turquoise waters, unspoiled beaches, and abundant marine life, it is a true paradise for nature lovers and those seeking an escape from the hustle and bustle of daily life. One of the most popular activities on Nemba Atoll is snorkeling, and for good reason. The coral reefs surrounding the island are teeming with colorful fish, sea turtles, and other fascinating marine creatures. Snorkeling in these waters provides a unique and unforgettable experience, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in the vibrant underwater world of Manemba Atoll. For those seeking a more immersive experience, scuba diving is a must-try activity. The coral reefs are home to a diverse array of marine life, including reef sharks, rays, and even dolphins. The clear waters provide excellent visibility, making it easy to explore the vibrant and diverse underwater ecosystem of Manemba Atoll. Besides snorkeling and diving, Manemba Atoll also offers visitors the opportunity to enjoy the island's stunning natural beauty. The beaches are unspoiled and uncrowded, providing a serene setting for relaxation and rejuvenation. Visitors can also take a stroll along the shoreline, observing the myriad of birds and other wildlife that call Manemba Atoll home. For those who are interested in sustainable tourism and conservation, Manemba Atoll is an ideal destination. The island is protected by a conservation organization, and visitors are encouraged to participate in the preservation of the island's delicate ecosystem. Visitors can learn about the various conservation efforts in place, and even participate in activities such as coral planting and beach cleanups. Jozani Forest is a magnificent tropical forest located in the center of Zanzibar Island. It is the only remaining natural forest on the island and is home to a vast array of flora and fauna, some of which are endemic to Zanzibar. The forest is home to the rare and endangered Zanzibar red colobus monkey, which can only be found in the wild on Zanzibar Island. The monkeys are a highlight of any visit to Jozani Forest, and visitors can observe them in their natural habitat as they play and feed in the trees. The forest is also home to other primates, including the Sykes monkey and the vervet monkey. Jozani Forest is an ideal destination for nature lovers and hikers. There are several well-marked trails that wind through the forest, 
offering visitors a chance to explore the various ecosystems within the forest. The trails vary in length and difficulty, and visitors can choose the one that suits their level of fitness and interest. In addition to its rich wildlife, Yozani Forest is also home to a diverse array of plant species. Visitors can observe towering trees, colorful flowers, and various types of ferns and mosses. The forest is also home to several rare plant species, some of which are used in traditional Zanzibari medicine. Visitors to Yozani Forest can also learn about the conservation efforts in place to protect the forest and its inhabitants. The forest is managed by the Jozani Chwaka Bay National Park, which is committed to preserving the forest's unique ecosystem and educating visitors about the importance of conservation. Zanzibar's spice farms are located in the heart of the island and are home to a wide variety of spices, including cloves, cinnamon, cardamom, and black pepper. These spices have been grown on the island for centuries and have played a significant role in the island's history and economy. Zanzibar was once one of the world's largest producers of cloves, which were highly sought after by traders from around the world. Today, the island's spice farms continue to produce high-quality spices that are used in cuisine and as a source of income for local farmers. Visiting a spice farm in Zanzibar is an experience like no other. Visitors can take a guided tour of the farm, where they will learn about the different spices grown on the island and how they are cultivated. The tour guides are typically local farmers who have spent their entire lives working on the farms and are experts in the field. They are passionate about their work and are eager to share their knowledge with visitors. During the tour, visitors will have the opportunity to see the spices growing in their natural environment and learn about their various uses. For example, they will learn how cloves are used in medicine to treat toothaches and how cinnamon is used to flavor food and drinks. Visitors may also get to see how the spices are harvested and processed, which can be a fascinating experience. Besides the educational aspect of the tour, visitors will also get to experience the flavors and aromas of the spices. Many tours include a spice tasting where visitors can sample various spices and learn how they are used in traditional Zanzibari cuisine. This is a fantastic opportunity to try new flavors and learn about the different spices that are used in the island's cuisine. The spice farms of Zanzibar also offer an opportunity to support local farmers and their communities. Many of the farms are small family-run businesses, and the income generated from tourism helps to support their livelihoods. By visiting a spice farm, visitors can directly contribute to the local economy and support sustainable agriculture practices. If you're looking for an idyllic paradise beach destination, Kendwa Beach in Zanzibar should be at the top of your list. Located on the northwest coast of the island, Kendwa Beach is a stunning stretch of white sand that offers crystal clear turquoise waters and spectacular sunsets. Today we will explore why Kendwa Beach is a must-visit destination in Zanzibar. First and foremost, Kendwa Beach is known for its picture-perfect setting. The beach is located in a secluded cove and is surrounded by lush green vegetation and palm trees, creating a peaceful and serene atmosphere. The waters are calm and inviting, perfect for swimming, sunbathing, or simply relaxing with a book. Another highlight of Kendwa Beach is the stunning sunsets. As the sun begins to set over the Indian Ocean, the sky explodes with vibrant shades of orange, pink, and purple, creating a breathtaking spectacle that is a sight to behold. This is the perfect time to take a stroll along the beach, take photos, or simply sit back and soak up the beauty of nature. Kendwa Beach is also a great destination for water sports enthusiasts. The calm waters make it an ideal location for activities such as snorkeling, diving, and stand-up paddleboarding. Visitors can also take a sunset cruise or go fishing with local fishermen. For those looking for a bit of nightlife, Kendwa Beach has plenty to offer. The beach is home to many bars and restaurants that offer a range of food and drink options. Visitors can enjoy local cuisines, such as fresh seafood and Swahili dishes, while sipping on a cocktail and listening to live music.
Borodani Night Market is a must-visit destination in Zanzibar. Located on the waterfront in Stonetown, this vibrant market comes alive every evening with the smell of delicious food, the sound of live music, and the energy of locals and tourists mingling together. The market is famous for its fresh seafood, including grilled octopus, prawns, and lobster. There are also a variety of other traditional Zanzibari dishes on offer, such as Zanzibari pizza, chapati, samosas, and skewered meat. The food is cooked on open grills and served straight from the vendor's stalls, creating a lively and exciting atmosphere. But Foradani Night Market is more than just a food market. It's a place where locals and tourists come together to enjoy the vibrant ambiance and socialize. Visitors can watch traditional music and dance performances and enjoy the company of fellow travelers and Zanzibari locals. The market is also a great place to experience the unique cultural fusion of Zanzibar. The food, music, and people reflect the island's multicultural heritage, with influences from Arabia, India, and Europe. Keep the fun going by clicking on the suggested video on the screen. For more travel content like this, don't forget to click the subscribe button. See you next time!